friends, it is so wonderful to be able to see you guys today. Isn't it incredible that we can meet right in our very own homes? I think that's pretty amazing. Now, can you guys remind me what we're learning about this month? I'll give you a hint. Who can you follow? That's exactly right. I can follow Jesus. And Jesus is such an incredible leader that I want to follow him everywhere. So when I ask you, who can you follow? I want you to say, I can follow Jesus. Amazing. Now, do you guys remember our memory verse for this month? Our memory verse reminds us that we can follow Jesus. Let's practice it a couple times, okay? Come, follow me, Jesus said. Matthew 4, 19. That was an amazing job. All right, we're going to practice it a couple times. Are you ready? Come, follow me, Jesus said. Matthew 4, 19. That was amazing. All right, we're gonna try it one more time so you can do it all on your own and show all of your friends and family. Are you ready? Come, follow me, Jesus said. Matthew 4, 19. That was a great job, you guys. Jesus is the most special leader and we can follow him anywhere. Now, I have an amazing story straight from the Bible all about how we can follow Jesus. Are you guys ready to hear it with me? All right, that's so great. Let's go to the clubhouse with Ollie and hear about it together. Are you ready? Let's go. Who? Who? You know what time it is. It's time to hear a story full of wonder. There's so much fun we'll have learning together. So let's go down, go down to the clubhouse with Ollie and his friends. Let's go down, down, down to the clubhouse where wonder never ends at the Wonder Clubhouse. We miss you at the Wonder Clubhouse. We miss you. Oh, hello there, friends. Welcome to the clubhouse. It's me, Lucy, and I'm so glad to see you all today. I'm having such a great time playing the game that Manny and I created, Be the Leader. Can you guess who I am? You guessed it, I'm a soccer coach. I lead my team and help them practice. Today, I'm setting up an obstacle course for them. Do you wanna see it? Okay, great. So first, we have to bounce the ball on our knees. Next, I set up hoops for them to jump through. And last but not least, we have to kick the ball into the goal. Goal, yes! I can't wait for my soccer team to try out this obstacle course. Being the soccer coach is so great. Who? Who? It's Ollie. Hello, Lucy. Who? Who? Pretending to be a soccer coach, are you? I sure am. I'm having so much fun playing the game that Manny and I created, Be the Leader. Today, I am a soccer coach. I made an obstacle course for my soccer team. Leading a soccer team is fun. It's true. Today's story is about someone who leads everyone, even you. Just listen to this story. Just follow me through. Who? Who? Follow me through. I'm Aisha and welcome to my cupcake food truck. Now normally I make one special cupcake a day, but today I made everyone cupcakes. <laughs> Strawberry, chocolate, pumpkin, gluten-free, dairy-free, lemon, sprinkles. They are for everyone and anyone. <laughs> Which reminds me of a story. If you're ready for a story, on the count of three, yell, tell me a story. One, two, three, tell me a story. Today's true story from the Bible begins in a town with lots of people. There were kids playing together, people shopping, and friends talking to each other. But look, do you see the man in the middle? That's Matthew. Let's watch and see if anyone talks to him. Do you see anyone? 
Nope. There are lots of people, but no one is talking to him. That's because Matthew was a tax collector. That means his job was to collect money for the town from everyone. The problem was that tax collectors took more than they were supposed to, which meant nobody wanted to be their friend. One day, Jesus came to town. God's son, the most special leader ever, came to town. And guess who he talked to? Can you guess? Yes! <laughs> he talked to Matthew. Jesus went right up to Matthew and said, follow me. Do you think Matthew followed him? <laughs> yes, of course. Matthew got up and followed him because Jesus is the most special leader. The people who saw Jesus talk to Matthew were confused. They didn't know why Jesus wanted to be friends with a tax collector. But everyone can follow Jesus and be his friend. Later, Jesus was having dinner at Matthew's house and everyone was invited. And I mean everyone. Let's help them serve the food. Everyone gets a plate of food. Let's count how many people we can serve. Ready? Go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. <laughs> Great job, guys. We served everyone who came to eat with Jesus at Matthew's house. And do you know why Jesus said to serve everyone? Because Jesus came so that everyone can follow him. Even if you're like Matthew and made a bad choice, Jesus came for all the people. Everyone can follow Jesus. Did you like the story? If you did, give it two thumbs up. Two thumbs up. Oh, hey there, Ollie. Tell me, who can you follow? I can follow Jesus. Yes, it's true. Now let's hear it from you. Tell me, who can you follow? I can follow Jesus. That's the truth, friends. You better believe it. See you next time. Bye. So there's your story. It's all true. Matthew followed Jesus, and everyone else can too. Thanks, Ollie. Goodbye to you. Who? Who? Wow, what a great story. Jesus is a friend to everyone because everyone can follow Jesus. I think I got the story. Did you get it? If you did, say got it. Get it? Good! Hey, you know what? I want everyone to come and get to enjoy my soccer obstacle course. Not just a soccer team. I'm going to invite all the kids in my neighborhood to come check it out. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye! Jesus came to serve everyone so that everyone can follow him. Isn't that incredible? Remind me, who can you follow? I can follow Jesus. That's amazing. One more time, as loud as you can. Who can you follow? I can follow Jesus. That's exactly right. I can follow Jesus. You can follow Jesus. Everyone can follow Jesus. Now let's fold our hands and thank God for sending Jesus so that everyone can follow him. Are you ready? Heavenly Father, thank you for loving us and for sending Jesus. Thank you for showing us that everyone can follow Jesus. We love you so much. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Thank you guys so much for spending time with me this week. I'll see you next time. Bye, friends.